Voglio raccontarvi una bellissima storia, la nostra, una meravigliosa avventura che coinvolge ogni giorno molte persone. È la storia vera della nostra gente, anche se assomiglia a una bellissima favola. There are stories that you sometimes don't expect, that are nice to discover and nice to tell. This story began many years ago. It's about a family whose roots go back in time. From father to son, generations of coffee bean merchants developed a trade that turned into a profitable business. And in this house, a child's dreams came true and began a long journey. Of course, coffee means tradition, but tradition is worthless if you cannot look to the future. So we shouldn't be surprised that this story begins with espresso coffee, an Italian symbol in the world, and gradually grows on a global scale to include every aspect of the coffee business and more. Today, Massimo Zanetti Beverage Group is an important multinational corporation that does business on every continent. It is the only 100% integrated group that directly controls every aspect of the coffee industry. It starts with green coffee beans, because only a strict control of the raw material can guarantee a delicious cup of superb coffee. That's what happens in Minas Gerais in Brazil, where an agro-industrial project was launched. Starting with its own coffee plant nursery, the project has developed innovative studies that respect cultivation of the plant and make it possible to always select the best coffee varieties, wherever they may be. Thus, the group also arrived in Hawaii, on the island of Kauai. Here, in harmony with the luxuriant natural scenery, ideal climate conditions make it possible to grow one of the best coffees in the world. Not only Brazil and Hawaii, but Costa Rica and Honduras too, where the first processing of green coffee takes place. In these countries, the group's export companies transfer the coffee from the heart of the production area to the heart of each market. Meanwhile, specific trading companies in Switzerland, Vietnam and Indonesia handle transactions with other coffee bean growers in other countries. So, Bean after bean, year after year, Massimo Zanetti Beverage Group eventually became the world's fifth largest coffee producer, with more than three million bags of raw coffee beans. Quite a lot, isn't it? Just think, if the bags were stacked one on top of the other, each year you could build a column 100 times higher than Mount Everest. You see, Coffee roasting is an art that requires experience and the ability to satisfy the traditions of every client, because each taste is unique and inimitable. That's why each product was created for a specific market, with production plants in Italy, Austria, Brazil, Costa Rica, France, Finland, the Netherlands, Poland, Scotland, and the United States.
why several international brands were created, each a leader in its own area or sector. Oh, no chock full of nuts can or do me just fine. Chock full of nuts, the heavenly coffee. Not just coffee brands, but also brands for high-quality colonial products, such as tea, cocoa, and spices. Experience, tradition, and technological innovation are assets of a brand that is a pioneer in the production of professional espresso machines and coffee-making equipment for cafes. And in the production of fine products, such as coffee pods and capsules, and espresso coffee makers for office coffee services. Thanks to its vision, Massimo Zanetti Beverage Group has created one of the largest international cafe chains, designed to offer the finest coffee anywhere in the world. From Paris to Tokyo, from Miami to Hong Kong, from Buenos Aires to Abu Dhabi, from New Delhi to New York, from the Caribbean to the Australian Coral Reef. That's because Massimo Zanetti Beverage Group is not just Italian. It is a major international group composed of more than 40 companies. The world's first privately owned coffee group. That achievement is the result of infinite love for the magical beverage. A sentiment that encourages us to think big, to invest and to find new countries where we can promote our products day after day. Our dream is to grow more coffee, develop the business, and increase consumption. That way, we can ensure the well-being of everyone working in the sector, including the people in those countries where the coffee business gives them the opportunity to develop and become stronger. Now the time has come to return home. Like the traders of yesteryear, along the road that takes us to the place where this journey began, many years ago. A place where tradition meets innovation and embraces the future, so we can achieve even more ambitious objectives. Because modernity cannot exist without roots, or a global vision without respect for tradition. Because this is the place where the story of this group was written, and where it writes its future. Because this is the point of arrival, and it will be the point of departure. <laughs>